Right, welcome back. Good evening, everybody. Hello, uh, Roxana, maybe Gabriela. We are four today, right? Okay, so let's get started. So uh, remember, we have some activities. So let's make a review of the topics that we have studied and have a review, right? Okay, what are the topics que hemos estado estudiando that we have been studying, guys? What are some of the structures, um, some vocabulary? So what are some of them? Mm -hmm. Who wants to uh, share, for example, the structures that we have studied, the vocabulary too? So what are some of them? Present progressive. All right, we studied the present. Progressive, that's good. So when do we use the present progressive? When do we use it? Cuando, when do we use it? Mm -hmm. When we are, when we are doing something in the moment. That's right, when we are doing something. Doing the moment. Oh, that's right. That is basically the main idea. Of the present progressive, we are doing something right now at the moment. Okay, thank you, Gabriela. What is the structure? What is the structure? What is the structure of the present progressive? Recordemos que cada estructura has their own pattern, right? What, what is the pattern of the present progressive? Affirmative. Okay, when we talk about affirmative sentences, muy bien, ¿cómo sería el estructura o affirmative? ¿Cuál sería la estructura, muy bien, para affirmative sentences? So, object plus verb to be, must verb, must verb, ing. Good, subject, right? Plus, verb to be, verb to be. Mm -hmm. Plus verb. Plus ing. Plus ing. Right. No se olvidemos de agregar el de to add the ing, right? Just a second. Okay. So, yes, right. We have to add the ing. Okay. So, what about the negative sentences? What about the negative sentences? ¿Cómo hacemos las sentences en negativo? Eh, subject plus verb to be plus not plus verb. Verb. ING. Mm -hmm. Verb to be, right? Verb to be. No nos olvidemos de agregar el not, right? O, el, o la forma contrastada. Then we have the uh, the verb right with ing. Okay, that's good. Very good, guys. Vimos también la estructura de las questions, right? too. And I don't know if you have questions about the topic. No sé si hay preguntas. Okay, no questions. Okay, vamos a ver este día unas uh, reglas, rules. When uh, adding the ing, okay, unas reglas that we have to know. Okay, let's get started. And this is going to be the topic for today. I hope we can cover this topic, right? So we're going to continue studying the present progressive and also the propositions of time. But before starting, let's uh, make a review of a vocabulary I have. Vamos a ver acerca de, del equipment that some people use in the workplace. Vamos a dar unos warnings. Vamos a ver unos warnings que son como unas eh, advertencias, right? The warnings of a workplace. Okay, so let's have this vocabulary in practice. Give me just a second to share. Study. Let's see? 
Okay, do you see my screen, guys? Let me know. There, it is much better. Okay, so let's um, let's choose right equipment. It says who is wearing safety equipment. Can you put Nando? Right, safety equipment. We have an engineer. We have a server. Carpenter, we have the janitor and the weather. So we have to choose three persons that are wearing safety equipment. Which are who are they, guys? Kineson, who are they? Mm -hmm. Carpenter. Yeah, do we have the carpenter? Mm -hmm. Welder. We have the welder, yeah. Mm -hmm. Janitor, no sé cómo se pronuncia. <laughs> Engineer. Yes, we, the engineer is the utilizing engineer. Uh, equipo seguro, safety equipment. No, no, no. no right. Uh, no. We have the, the weather, right? The city of Estados Sando, for example. He has the, the arm mask. He has the gloves, too. And uh, we have the janitor. Janitor. Uh -huh. The janitor, too, el conserve. Okay, so that is part of the vocabulary. So let's let's continue. Okay. Okay, let's continue. Okay. So when we are uh, talking about the workplace, there are some like uh, words that we can use. So let's check some of the words and then we are going to watch a video. Okay, let's see. We have uh, the word get hard. Get hard is uh, lastimarse. Get hard. Okay, then we have the word safety equipment. Safety, safety equipment. equipment. Then we have breathing, right? Breathing is respiro profundo, breathing. Let's see. Breathe in. Breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and breathe out. Then we have construction site. Construction site. Then we have, uh, let's listen. Dust mask. Dust mask. Vamos a ver que es una dust mask. ¿Se recuerdan de... Veamos esto. This one. Let me show you the dust mask. Let's see, this one is the dust mask. That is the dust mask. So we have the next one that it is the ear plaques. The ear plaques are son los, eh, unos que tienen parecidos a estos. The ear plaques the next one. Then we have feet. Is, tiene bastante significado feet. Something. Por ejemplo, algo que le quede a usted, algo que sea adecuado para usted, algo que se adapte. That is feet. Then we have the word gloves, right? Those gloves, the guantes that most of the people wear for the equipment. Then we have the hard hat. Tenemos el hard hat. This one, the hard hat. Then we have the protect. We have some protection. It can be the equipment, right? The protection or protect something. Then we have put on. Put on is, it is like when we estamos probando, right? We estamos poniendo your safety equipment. Then we have the reflective vest. Okay, the reflective vest is the um, equipo, let's say. Es el como that they use, chaleco, right? El chaleco that they wear. Then we have safety glasses. This one's safety glasses. Then we have a try on, es medirse, try on something. Okay, do you have questions about of the words? No sé si tenemos dudas. 
because we are going to watch a video. Vamos a ver un video y vamos a utilizar this vocabulary. Uh -huh. No questions? Oh, tenemos some of them here, right? Tenemos work boots también, right? Work boots. Hay unos ingenieros that they wear uh, these work boots. Then we have be careful. Be careful. Hay que tener cuidado. Be careful. Broken puede significar um, algo que está arruinado, right? Broken, algo que está roto. Too. Then we have ladder, que son las escaleras de ladder. And then we have look out, como cuando la agarran de desprevenido y este mira, look out, o ten cuidado, too, right? Then we have the oven, okay? The oven, it's another equipment, este también lo utilizan, for example, something like that. We have the oven, that are, son los hornos, and then we have pay attention, right? Ok, vamos a escuchar y luego la pronunciación y luego voy a escoger to some of you para que podamos leer en practice pronunciation. Okay, vamos a escuchar este voz y luego ustedes me ayudan to read, right? Let's see. Get hurt. Safety equipment. Breathe in. Construction site. Dust mask. Earplugs. Fit. Gloves. Hard hat. Protect. Put on. Reflective vest. Safety glasses. Try on. Work boots. Be careful. Broken. Ladder. Look out. Oven. Pay attention. Okay, so let's, uh, do you have questions? No sé, los que se acaban de incorporar, do you have questions about uh, the word, for example, pronunciation, any word? Say, uh, number two. Number two, safety equipment. Uh -huh. Safety equipment. Safety equipment. Mm -hmm. Es equipment. Es equipo, ajá, equipo, eh, lo que se ocupan como el equipo... De seguridad. Ajá, de, ya. Yeah. Bueno, de que se utiliza como herramienta. Pero la pronunciación, no. Safety equipment. Safety equipment. Safety equipment. No sé si la verdad, pero es como los trajes, eh, casco, right, the, the boots, the gloves. That is the safety equipment. Mm -hmm. Por ejemplo, you, Wendy, usted creo que utiliza safety equipment, right? Like the jacket, the black jacket, the gloves to right, the mask can be the safety equipment. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, any other guys, any other word? Reflective vest. I'm sorry? A reflective vest. Repeat. Reflective vest is. Arriba oh, de oh, yes, yes. Reflective vest. It is like. Uh, I said I forgot it. Let me just check. It is like chaleco reflector. Creo que son como los amarillos or something like that. I'm not quite sure, but I have the idea that that is. Let me just show you a picture. So if you can control the image. Mm. Oh yes, right. Okay, let me just show you. Okay. Can you see? These are the reflective, right? There. Mm. Okay, there you have right. 
Okay, any other? Teacher. Eh, de number three. Number three, construction site. Es como un sitio, un sitio que está... Yes. En, o, o what? Breathing. Breathing. Breathe after oh. safety. Breathing. This one, right? Es como respirar profundo. Breathing. Breathing. Okay, thanks. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Pay attention. Pay attention. Eh, pongamos atención, right? Pay attention, right? Uh, poner atención. Oven. Eh, oven. Ya, yeah, uh -huh. es oven es el horno. Oven. Oven. Horno. Oven. Yes. Ok. El horno. Okay. ¿Qué significa, teacher? Disculpe. Oven es el horno, el horno. horno. Ah, el horno. Uh -huh. Okay, so let's listen some of your uh, pronunciations, right? So let's see, uh, Emma, please, can you read? Vamos a leer. This is para practice pronunciation. Okay, can you read from get hurt until? Let's see until dust mask. Podemos leer, please. Can you read, Emma? Uh -huh. Good evening, teacher. Sí, Emma. Okay. Get hard. Uh, Say the equipment. 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 Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. Breathe. Breathe in. Breathe in. Breathe in. Yeah. Okay. Constru construction site. Okay, construction site. Uh, dust mask. Dust mask. Okay, excellent, Emma. Very good. Okay. okay, let's listen now to Roxana. Can you read from earplugs? Vamos a leer from earplugs until protect, please. Mm. Earplugs. Mm. Read. Close. Mm -hmm. Our hat protect. Yes, perfect, protect. Perfect, Roxana. Okay, let's continue with the next one. Uh, Cynthia, please. From put on until try on. And put on, reply the bag, safety glasses, try on. Okay, safety glasses, right? Ah, okay. safety glasses. Yes, safety, safety glasses. Safety glasses. Okay. Okay, okay thank, thank you. you. Okay, let's listen another. Can you continue? Let's see. Andrea, please, welcome. From work boots to uh, ladder, please, ladder. Mm -hmm. Work boots. Creo que tenemos problemas con el audio, Andrea, porque no se escucha. Estas imágenes se repiten a diario. Los que ven obligados a caminar en plena vía de la obstaculización de la ciudad. Eh, Cuerpos, vehículos abandonados, eh, be careful, no permitidos por líder. Vamos a llevar a los líderes de la grúa hacia Changai. Ahí le va a tocar este parado. Y que veamos totalmente despejadas. Vamos entonces, ladder right then, without, without oven, pay attention. Okay, let's, okay, let's watch the video. Vamos a utilizar viewers for the next, just a second, prepare the video. Let's see. Are you the new construction worker? Yes, I'm Manny. Hi, Manny. I'm Frank, your supervisor. I have some safety equipment for you. 
We don't want accidents on the construction site. This is a hard hat. It protects your head. Thank you, sir. These are safety gloves. Do they fit? Yes, sir, they fit. You need work boots. What's your size? I'm an 11. Here are some boots in your size. Try them on later. OK, sir. Put on these safety glasses. Thank you, sir. I'll do that. And take this, too. What's this? That's a dust mask. There's sometimes a lot of dust on the construction site. You don't want to breathe in the dust. No, sir, I don't. And these are earplugs. Oh. And it's a good idea to wear this reflective vest so people can see you. Thank you, sir. Anything else, sir? I think that's enough to get started. Oh, and Manny? Yes, sir? Call me Frank. Yes, sir. I mean Frank. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, guys, so there you have the video, right? As you can see, they used all of the words of the study. Um, okay, what was the video about, Jonathan? Tell me, please. What was the video about? This is the video. Mm -hmm. um, the equipment. Protection. Yes, exactly, right, about the, the equipment for protection, right? Okay, so basically that was the main idea. So let's answer some questions about the video, and you help me in that part. Okay, let's see. If Frank is Manny's supervisor. Is that true or false, guys? True. Mm -hmm. True. True, okay, check that. Okay, what about Frank is showing money the construction site? Is that true or false? False. False. Okay, false. false. I'm going to check that. Money doesn't need safety gloves. Is that true or false? False. 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 Okay. Many doesn't want to use the dust mask. False. Oh. It's bad for you to breathe in dust. True. True. Okay. We're going to check. And that's correct, right? Congratulations, guys. Okay, so that was the video. Let's come back to the grammar section that we have. Remember that we have uh, the rules. We have the prepositions of place. So, les recomiendo que veamos videos for you to practice English. Por ejemplo, las series que veamos, veamos las inglés. Y eso nos va a ayudar a that. We'll see the difference. Okay, so let's go over the prepositions of time. And then we're going to go over the rules of the present progressive. So when we talk about the prepositions of time, we use on, at, in between. There are some others. Okay, we have uh, estas noticias, por ejemplo, eh, para utilizarlos con los días, para utilizar con partes del día, por ejemplo. También los pueden utilizar con estaciones también. And uh, yes, vamos a ver entonces, se pueden can you help me with the information, please, Sofia? Can you help me to read 4.1, 4. please? Hello, hola, Sofia. Can you help me with this part? Maybe a little, please, Sofia. 
Yes, good evening. Um, use in plus part of the day. Can always go for a walk in the afternoon. On Mondays, I work in the morning. Use in plus month. Mm -hmm. My birthday is in December. Vietnam is beautiful in April. Using plus season. What Waltham is very cold in the winter. Please visit me in the spring. Okay, excellent. Thank you, Sofia. So we have that in. Utilizamos con las partes del día, right? Parts of the day. Tenemos in the afternoon, in the morning, in the evening, right? Cuando utilizamos en la noche, vamos a decir at night. Eso sí, tengamos lo cuidado. No vamos a decir in the night, no. Decimos at night. Okay, es la única opción. We don't use in. Okay, so we have uh, also in, que lo vamos a utilizar with los meses, right? In December, in November, in April, etc. Then we have that thing, lo vamos a utilizar también con las seasons, con las estaciones del año, right? Tenemos the winter, in the summer, in the spring, en este caso winter, en el invierno. Y tenemos el spring, que es la primavera, en la primavera. Okay, questions about this part? No sé si hay dudas. No question, okay. Okay, ¿cuáles son las tres formas? ¿Cuáles son las tres formas en que puedo utilizar in? Which are the three ways to use in, guys? Uh -huh. Parts of the day. Another one, good, Gabriela. Months and seasons. That's right. Okay, excellent. Okay, ¿puedo decir in the night? ¿Puedo decir in the night? The night in the night? No. No. Night. No, right. We can say at night. We have to say at night. Okay. Then we have uh, uh, on right. On, lo vamos a utilizar for dates. Dates, vamos a escribir right the number, but say the ordinal number. Los ordinal numbers, los vamos a ver más adelante también. Estamos pendientes de that. Okay, entonces, when we have a date very specific, we are going to use on, on July the 1st, right? On May the 20th. Por ejemplo, si usted cumple el 3 de mayo, on May 3rd. Voy a compartir una imagen de los ordinals, porque esos los utilizamos cuando damos una fecha exacta, right? So, that is basically the use of the on the on right. Okay, let's see the other part. We use on plus day. See you on Monday. Lo vamos a utilizar también con día. Right? See you on Friday. Then we use at. At, ya estudiamos, right? We study that and we use it for a specific time. At seven, we study the time, right? Ya hemos estudiado la hora. So questions about on and at? Mm -hmm. Questions? Mm -hmm. Por ejemplo, si me preguntan cuándo es su cumpleaños, when is your birthday? My birthday is on May 3rd, in the case of life. My birthday? is on May 3rd. Ordinal numbers. Okay, let's, let's see some of you. When is your birthday? Uh, let's see, Stephanie, when is your birthday? My, ber my birthday on? On? Uh -huh. On? June 
25. Ok, 25. Estamos bien porque todavía no hemos visto los ordinales, pero voy a compartir una imagen para que tengamos esa información. Ok, okay very good. Excellent. Okay, thank you, Stephanie. Ok, what about you, uh, Raquel? When is your birthday? Is your birthday? Is your birthday? Um, my birthday is October. Mm -hmm. Okay, my birthday. Pero qué día? My birthday is uh, on uh, on uh, four. October 4th. Very good. Very good. October 4th. Okay. Questions. Thank you, Raquel. Questions. No sé si hay dudas. No. Les voy a compartir esa información. You can just a moment. Acerca de los ordinals. Que eso se utiliza a la app cuando estamos hablando de días muy específicos. Can you just Y les voy a compartir una sola vez un video para que veamos la pronunciación también. Porque no es lo mismo decir three que decir third, right? So, let me just see. Let's see. Okay. Let's see. Let me know if you can see the information, please, guys. Ahí está. The ordinal numbers y también les voy a compartir. Mm -hmm. See? Oh, this one is one of my favorites. Espero les pueda ayudar. Okay, so questions about these topics? Mm -hmm. Questions? Mm -hmm. No questions, guys? No. So we are good. Okay, so we, we have a study in, on, and at. When do we use on? When do we use on? When do we use on? Mm -hmm. For a specific day. For a specific days. Muy bien. And day. And days. Perfect, Alice. Okay, what about at? When do I use at? Mm -hmm. When do I use at? For a specific time. For a specific time. time. That's right. Perfect, Sofia. For a very specific time. Okay, let's practice. Vamos a practicar this part. And uh, you help me with this. Okay, we have to find the correct information, right? Okay, so can you help me with the first one? Maybe. Me ayuda a leer, maybe, la number one, please. Good evening. Evening, maybe. In my stay, mm -hmm. it's very cool mm -hmm. in the winter. Mm -hmm. In very hot mm -hmm. in the summer. Excellent, excellent. Maybe we use this in this case. In right, in. Okay, let's go with number two, Karina. Please, number two. Uh, the, the the warm weather usually start on in, in April. Mm -hmm. y, is it on four? Será que es in, in April or on? Oh, on on April. April. Ah, oh. no, sería the warm weather usually start on April. In April, no es in in. 
Yo digo que no es in. <laughs> okay, what do you mm. think, guys? What is the correct response? In. The correct in. in. Ah, yes, sí, in. sí. Recordemos, hay un, hay un, there is a triangle, se lo voy a compartir también, donde podemos ver las especificaciones, right, también. I'm going to share that information. That will help us more. Perfect, thank you, Karina. So we have the next one. Let's see, Alejandra, number three, we have Can you read it, please? Unfortunately, unfortunately. Hello, Alejandra. Hello, Alas, are you? Alejandra. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Uh, Jose, please help us. Okay, number mm -hmm. three. Number three, please. Unfortunately. Okay. Um, unfortunately, in rains a lot in the spring. Mm -hmm. Será que es in or on? What What is the correct one? In spring is the como in. tiempo. Season. Season. Mm -hmm. Season. Right. Right? Yes. Seasons. Season. Yes. Entonces, por la temporada. Ok, excelente. Okay. Right? Uh -huh. ok, what about. Ok, perfect. Thank you, José. Ok, let's continue with the next one. Me ayuda, Alejandra, please. Four. The first. Sorry, teacher. Se me problem. salió. Con... Uh -huh. The first. Uh, the first day uh -huh. of summer is. Mm. ¿Será que es in or on? Sería. In. In. What do you think? In June. Mm, what do you think, guys? ¿Será que es in, in or on? In. Exactly. Vamos a utilizar in, in right? Recordemos que in es para los meses in June. Okay, very good. Jonathan, please, number five. In the summer. In the summer, the sun goes down late. In the evening. That's right. Recordemos que también in se utiliza para las parts of the day. That's right. Okay, very good. So the next one, Emma, please, number six. Number it's six. It's style. Mm -hmm. It's style sunny. Feels sunny. Mm -hmm. It's style sunny when I finish my class at seven. That's right. We must add this better tempo, right? We must this word. It is still a woman. It's still. Sunny. Mm -hmm. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Emma. The next one, please, Roxana, number seven. I usually stay up late in Fridays and look at the store. Mm -hmm. ah, okay, on Fridays. Very good, but it's Fridays. Okay, perfect. Okay, the next one, please, uh, Wendy, the last one. I like to wake up mm -hmm. at six. Mm -hmm. uh, Everything? Very good. Uh, on some Saturday, because the, the winter is the stay weather cool. Still. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. The weather is stay cool. In the morning. Morning. Okay, perfect. Wendy, excellent. Okay, questions about this part. También les voy a compartir una imagen que está muy interesante. Sí. Esta, la, que, la información que les voy a compartir, that one, I think it is the best, right? 
better idea of this topic. Okay, we have uh, other words here, right? Tenemos around, tenemos about. Like when you say, te veo por las tres de la tarde, por las tres y media. So you can say around. Then we have between, entre. Tenemos que utilizarlo entre dos horas, right? We have, see you between six and seven. Te veo entre las seis y las siete. Okay, questions about that part? Questions? Mm -hmm. No questions? Okay, good. So let's move on to practice. Now you're going to be working in the breakout room. So ustedes van a trabajar en los breakout rooms. Vamos a hacer two activities. And uh, just let me finish and complete this part. part. Let's see. Okay, let's see. We have to avoid the mistakes, right? Tenemos que evitar los mistakes. Okay, let's see. Uh, we have, for example, que in, lo vamos a utilizar with month. Lo que hemos estudiado, the on or dates or days. Tenemos el ejemplo. Use at, digamos, este es un summary para el tiempo. Then we have use on. Esto lo vamos a ver más adelante cuando sean de... Cuando sea de... Eh, lo vamos a ver más adelante, es otro tema. Ok, cuando estamos hablando de street name o address, también lo vamos a ver. Y también, we use on on the ordinal number floor, que los, lo que les he compartido de los ordinal numbers, utilizamos el on. Ok, let's uh, review this. Let's review this. Vamos a encontrar um, the mistakes. Vamos a encontrar los errores. Okay. Help me. Vamos a encontrar the mistakes. Let's see. Eh, Jose, please, can you help me read? Me ayuda a leer. Y se me indica what the mistakes are. Okay. Uh -huh. eh, eh, leer. Yeah, read, read. Okay. Hi, Everly John. I have some new. I have some new in an invitation, but it can't tour 25 year or in September. Mm -hmm. And I want to have a party for him. In for to Natalie, mm -hmm. his birthday is is it seems is 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 him on the on the is on September on September muy bien September two okay so yeah uh, all right Okay, continue, please. Of September 2, ¿cómo se dice? Dos, usted mandaba algo ahí. Second. 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 And that in Monday. Mm -hmm. In Monday. Okay. Money. Okay. Sorry? Continue, continue. Okay. Money of who choose have to work. Uh, um, and they. Mm -hmm. What about Monday, guys? Será que es in? Okay, ahí estoy. On. Uh -huh. On. Oh, yes, right. On the day. On right. On Monday. On the day. Okay. Continue, please, Jose. Many of us. Okay. Many of us have to work on that day. Mm -hmm. Silet have his party. Uh, 
on on August. That's right. On August, right? August. Mm -hmm. August thirty-one. Hmm. That is that ohms. Huh? Mm -hmm. That on Saturday. Okay. Let's all let's all me as me a part at at my part a part seven club mm -hmm. uh, on at my apartment mm. at my apartment seven uh, at, 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 at okay at in Saturday at seven o'clock. At seven o'clock Saturday. On Saturday, right? Oh. Mm -hmm. I can invite um, Big Crown to me apartment to in weekend surprise him. Mm -hmm. We can take him to his favorite restaurant. Mm -hmm. There's a great Spanish. Restaurant in Grad in es uh, lugar, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Pues si específico. At. Yes, at right. At Grand Avenue in Hope, you can or can. My apartment is 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 in. Is mm -hmm. a Bray, Brian place I like in the on the on mm -hmm. on the floor. It is in third floor. Okay, ahí estamos bien. Ahí estamos bien porque mm -hmm. el floor es un lugar, right? Okay. Eso lo vamos a ver la otra semana. Okay. Okay. Estamos good. Yo creo que estamos bastante. Questions about this part? Okay, no questions? Okay, good guys. Sí, sí, sí. Uh -huh. sí tengo una duda. Uh -huh. Yes. Eh, donde dice is birthday in September 2. Debería de ir el TH para decir second? O el estaría second? bien así. Fíjense que uh -huh. hay varios que lo omiten, pero usualmente cuando los es, cuando usted está hablando o diciendo su texto se utiliza más que todo en la forma hablada. ¿Okay? Uh -huh. También en la fecha se utiliza bastante. Uh -huh. En la forma hablada se utiliza. Teacher. Uh -huh. Yes, Jonathan. Eh, no sé, entendí que en la parte del, donde dice 25 years old in September. Sería lo correcto en la primera parte. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. In September. Por, ajá. In September sería el correcto. Porque sí, en el, luego dice his birthday is on September. O sea, ¿por qué iría on en esa parte? A very good question. The only difference, si nos fijamos aquí, se dice September, right? Que acá se nos vemos September. Pero cuando usted se dan algo más específico, Podemos entrar en septiembre, pero tenemos el so, Estamos siendo más específicos, por eso estamos utilizando el in. ¿Qué sería on? No oh, perdón, caso. perdón. Sorry, on. Yes. On. Ok. Thank you. Ok. That's the point. Right? Ok. Questions. Teacher, o sea que cuando eh, solamente se refiere al mes es in. Pero cuando ya especifique fecha sería on. Exacto, así es. Así es. Okay. Uh -huh. eh, si se fijan, les he compartido en el WhatsApp eh, la información también. Ahí especifica bastante, por ejemplo, on. Ahí, en el WhatsApp ahí está esa imagen. Lo utilizamos con days, dates, right. Eh, los in, que lo utilizamos con months, con years con a decade to century seasons and time periods. Okay, so para que tengamos the idea of these repetitions. A veces nos podemos confundir, like right? we are speaking, we don't know what to say, if it is in or at, etc. 
Ok, so we are going to be working in this activity. Vamos a estar trabajando in this one. Lo único que vamos a hacer is to use uh, in, on, at, around, or between, right? Vimos estas. It's two words, right? Okay, and uh, we are going to use them here in this section. In the second part, now that you have uh, corrected the test, the, the information text, you are going to create your own meeting celebration, right? You're going to invite persons. For um, that, you will create this card or this text or this email, right? Vamos a crear un email invitando, right? To your friends, maybe, to your party. So, podemos utilizar this template, o si no, y voy a compartir otros templates que podemos encontrar en internet. Okay, questions? Yes, Alice, you tell me. Mm -hmm. Teacher, um, and the, um, when say my apartment is on a brave place, is on because it's a specific direction. We're going to study that, the preposition of place. That is another topic. Okay. 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 So by now we are going to have the ones that we have studied, right? With time. Okay. okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Podría repetir, pero explicar en español, por favor. Don't worry. No worry. Es que no worry. entendí lo último. There's no worries. Okay. So in the primera parte, vamos a completar utilizando in, on, or at, right? Around and between. En la segunda parte, vamos a hacer una eh, meeting celebration. Usted va a tener una fiesta, right? It can be a birthday, a party, a festivity. Y vamos a utilizar eh, una invitación, right? Podemos tomar este ejemplo. Eh, podemos hablar de, de data de la invitación, por ejemplo. ¿Cuándo va a ser? ¿Qué va a encontrar? Es decir, sí. en este caso, redactaríamos nosotros como tu invitación. Ok, ok. Thank you. Por ejemplo, después de soltera, de soltero, it can be any right. Anybody, a wedding too, right. Les voy a compartir algunos templates, just in case you want to change. Ok. So, let's go to the breakout rooms. And uh, we, eh, los, las cars van a ser individuales. Las el texto va a ser individual. Okay, let's see. Hola, hola, Vero, Víctor. Llamas, Víctor. Are you there? Let's see. Hello, Vero. Hola, hola, Vero. Hello, estamos ahí, Vero.
Eh, jangan lupa oh, membuat. Jangan lupa sakar. <laughs> Hello, Alison dan Roxana. Sí, ya, habis rápido. Quizás solo era para el ejercicio 1, entonces. <laughs> no, Roxana, Elis, Alison. <laughs> Do you have questions? Hola. Siempre se me asustan. Hola. Es que pensé que ya nos había sacado. Sí, yo... No sé. <laughs> ok, ¿do you have questions? ¿Tenemos dudas? No, ya me ¿No? vamos ya por la, bueno. por el segundo, la segunda actividad, la carta. Ok, ah, la invitación. Ya. Ok, perfecto, perfecto. Las dejo trabajar. Ya tenemos, eh, recordemos que las tarjetas son individuales, right? Una es por uh -huh. otra. And the other one is for Alison. What is going to be the topic of your car, Roxana? Or the celebration? Okay. ¿Qué vamos a celebrar for your car? Uh, the baby, my son. Ah, your son's birthday. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's good. What about you, Alison? Maybe my birthday or my brother's birthday is too easy. Ah, okay, okay. ¿Y va a haber eh, regalo de sobre o not? Sí, mejor no voy. <laughs> <laughs> ok, I'll let you work, I'll let you work guys. Okay, thank you. Okay, thanks.
Okay, guys, let's present your cars, right? You're going to present your cars. And uh, yes, I'm curious about what your celebration is. Okay. Let's see, Stephanie, please, do you have your car? Or your email text? Mm -hmm. Stephanie? Mm -hmm. Are you going to share, Stephanie? Vamos a compartir. Sí, perdón, perdón. Es que, es que estaba todo loco. Bye. A ver cómo, a ver cómo me sale este bola. Go ahead. Okay. I want to make a attentive invitation to all. It's my birthday party. It will be very funny. I will be 35 years old. My pie is in the June 25. I know, person. Bueno, 25. Después veo cómo se dice, cómo es 25. And that's on Saturday. Mm -hmm. The party is in my house at 6 p.m. o'clock. Mm -hmm. It's for in June. It's my favorite month, even, even if it is raining, lloviendo. Raining? Huh? Rain, raining at that time of years. The season is winter. Mm -hmm. This ah. is going to be in winter or in, winter? Uh, winter. In, in winter. Okay, perfect. También podemos utilizar el turn. I will turn. Ese es el del futuro, ¿verdad? I will. I will. Muy bien. I turn. It turns. Tendré, right? Mm. That can be another way to say. Okay. Thank you, Stephanie. Very good. Hasta ahí me quedé. Hasta ahí me quedé. Very, very, very good. It, it okay. was very essential, right? Okay. Thank you, Stephanie. Choose the next person, please. La siguiente persona. Yeah. Okay. Este, espérame, quiero uh -huh. ver. Eh, así, no, no es porque me caigan mal ni nada, así solo lo voy a escoger. Eh, José, ahí está. Okay. ok, ok. It's nothing personal, José. Go ahead, please. <risa> ok. Um, eh, la invitation. Yes. Ok. Eh, bueno, ahí pusimos. Hi, friend. I have some um, invitation. My brother uh, tours 40 years or in August. In August, in, I want to have my mm -hmm. dinner. My dinner. Mm -hmm. dinner. The beer day on Monday. Uh, on Monday. Mm -hmm. That's that's. You. That's why I'm going, going to my diner on Sunday. Let me as my house at two at two on Sunday twenty year. No, Sunday uh, twenty twentieth. Uh, twentieth. And twenty. Mm -hmm. Twenty. I hope you can I come. I hope you can come. Okay. okay. Hope you can come. I hope you can make it, right? Make it. Expression también. I hope you can make it. The same like I hope you can come. Okay. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay. Thank you, Jose. Okay, the next person, please, Jose, the next one. Um, Emma. Emma, okay, Emma, please. <laughs> it's nothing personal, nothing personal, Emma. <laughs> okay. Hi, friends. It is a pleasure for me. I invite my birth expression. Mm -hmm. The event will be held on 28 at the end. Mm -hmm. 
there will be friends, uh, lots of food, surprise, and of course, a dancing party. I share the address of the parent home. Okay. Casi no se le escuchó, perdón. Eh, casi no le escuché, Emma. Se está entrecortado. Ok, si lo puede, no sé si lo podría repetir, please. Casi no, no alcancé a escuchar. Ok. Uh -huh. Hi, friends. Uh, it is a pleasure for me. I invite you uh, to my birthday celebration. Uh -huh. uh, the event will be held on June, June 28 at 6 o'clock p.m. Uh -huh. at my parent house. There will be drinks, uh, lost food, surprise, and of course, and dancing parties. Okay, perfect. Um, okay, perfect. Excellent, excellent. Um, I'm curious about the drinkings. Estoy curious about the drinkings, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, Emma, thank you. Okay, the next person, please, Emma. The next person. Karina. Okay, Karina. <laughs> okay, where is she? Oh, Karina, Karina. There you are, Karina. Parece que todavía tenemos problemas, Karina. Hola, hola. Soy. Oh, hola. Yes. yes. Hello. Hello. Hi, partners. Um, Yo voy a hacer una invitación. A ver si me entienden. Hi, partners. I have an invitation for you. We will be celebrating the day of the family next the Saturday, 11 John, from uh, uh, 8 to 11 a.m. We will be sharing games, great mm -hmm. plays, food and many gifts for children and adults. Mm -hmm. We will also be presenting a ballet and a Hawaiian dance with boys and girls around and, and five to six years old. We will have a morning, a many surprise. We are waiting for you. It's, una, it's a reality celebration. Celebration. <laughs> celebration. Yes. Uh, and then celebration. my work in this Saturday. Okay, it's going to be for this Saturday, okay? Where? Where is it going to be? Sí, so, yeah. Where? ¿A dónde? Where, Karina? Yeah, es, es que no le puse porque no sabía cómo es que canchas, <laughs> unas canchas de polideportivo. <laughs> okay, in like in the sport field, it can be like. Right. Can see. Okay. Okay. Ah, sí, claro. so, okay, thank you, Karina. Tengamos cuidado around, eh, escuché que dijo around, digamos, eight to five, eight, uh, five to six, digamos. Okay, ah, eh, es, sería sí, between, ¿verdad? Sería. Between. Ah, sí, sería, ah, ok, between the, the between the five, five to six. six. Five and six, right, between five. Six. Six years old. Okay. Oh, from. También podemos utilizar from. From five to six. Oh, five to six. Okay. 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 Thank you, Karina. Okay. So let's let the next person, please, Karina. The next person. Um, vamos a ver. Dennis. Hey. Oh no, Dennis is not here. We miss uh, Dennis, but let's start. He's not here. Entonces, eh, Jonathan. Okay, Jonathan, please go ahead. Hi, Priyan. I am having a birthday party next Friday, my 25 mm -hmm. at my house. Would you like to come? It's be fun. Mm -hmm. Lots 
of people from my English class are coming. Mm -hmm. My address is 15 mm -hmm. Avenue in Main Street. Main Street. Main Street, pardon. Mm -hmm. The celebration starts at 3 p.m. and finishing at 5 p.m. Okay, and it will finish at 5 p.m., okay? If a retro games, cake, tea, and ice cream. And ice creams, okay. I will be there for the ice cream, for sure. Okay, thank you, Jonathan. The next person, please, Jonathan, the next person. Quiero ver si identifico los que están acá. Sería uh, Sofía. Ok, Sofía, please. Ok. Uh, my invitation is to my family. Hi, everyone. This invitation is for the meeting at the grandmother's house. Please arrive on Saturday between. 10 30 p.m. and 11 o'clock for for cook the for cook the lunch you have to park on the street and remember in june is the birthday is the birthday of grandfather mm -hmm. bring something for him mm -hmm. i wait for you all that okay, sounds... yes, that sounds great. A family party, right? Not for us, right? Just the family. Okay, thank you. Sophia, please, the next person. Um, uh, Roxana. Okay, Roxana, please. Okay. Hello, everyone. Uh, received a cordial invitation to the celebration of my daughter's 16th birthday, which will take place on February 14 at 6 p.m. in the Las Magnolias event room. On located on the Pan American Highway to the San Miguel. We will wait for you. Okay, yeah. Okay. It sounds great, the invitation, right? Vamos a tomar una expression que dijo Roxana, it will take, right? Se llevará a cabo, right? Okay, or it will be held también. It will be held. Vamos a, ustedes van a ver más adelante. Se llevará a cabo también. It will be held. That is another way. Okay, thank you, Roxana. Let's, Roxana, please, the next person. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe she's going to present, okay? Maybe. Hello. I have some news and in invitation. Celebration my 27 year old. Want to have party. Mm -hmm. His birthday is on May 24. Mm -hmm. And that's on Friday. Let's all meet in my house at 6 a.m. Mm -hmm. on Friday. Mm -hmm. And we can we can surprise him that we can take him to this favorite mm -hmm. restaurant with X White House. You are cordially invited to my party, thanks. Okay, very good. Okay, so we have an, an expression that may be used. You are cordially invited, right? Invited. Van a ver ustedes este tiempo, más adelante, right? But we read to the pronunciation, invited. Invited, you are invited to my party. Excellent. Okay, thank you, maybe the next person, please, uh, maybe. Can you choose the next person? Wendy. Okay, Wendy, please, go ahead. Okay, 
You are invitation to enjoy use for graduation party. Um, honorary uh, Wendy Alvarado from University of El Salvador. The first uh, one July will start um, will start at 19 p.m. The resid the Wendy resident La Unión El Salvador. Posteriormente, no sé cómo hacer. It can be consequently. Yes, consequently. Desde ya, from now on, congratulations, Wendy. Desde ya, my invitation, my celebration to you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, for example, when you say you are, verdad? You are invited. Invited, invited. Okay, you are invited. No podemos decir your, your, uh, you, you're invited in this way. No, right. Porque acá estamos utilizando un posesivo, right. El apóstrofe and the e. You're invited or you are invited. Pero actualmente cuando hacemos correos, en este caso cars, vamos a utilizar la forma larga. La forma corta, in this way, es más que todo para speaking. Ok. So, thank you. Wendy, please, the next person. Victor. Victor is here. Victor, yes, there you are. Hello, Victor, are you there? Victor. Okay. Wendy, please, another person. Another person, please. Mm -hmm. In mass, Wendy. I think it is missing. Gabriela, Alejandra is missing. Let's see. Cynthia is missing. Alejandro. Gabriela. Okay, Gabriela. Nothing personal, Gabriela. Nothing personal. No, no. <laughs> okay, go ahead, please, Gabriela. Share. <laughs> Can I share? Just a second. I'm going to press the button for you. Okay, go ahead. Oh, that's cute. Uh, we can wait for you to attend our, our wedding, the uh, Gavin Ernesto wedding. Uh, the date is on February 26, and 2026 at 6.30 p.m. The place is in Quinta Silvera in 3.5 kilometers on highway in San Jose Villanueva. And please confirm attendance and we see you in the afternoon. Okay, congratulations, Gabby. Right, for your wedding. Regalo de sobre, por favor, regalo de sobre. <laughs> okay, thank you, Gabriela. Okay, is that your, I mean, are you going to get married, Gabriela, in the later? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, okay, Gabriela, later, right. Okay, Gabriela, please choose the next person, please. Andrea. Andrea. Andrea, Andrea. Oh, there you are, Andrea. You were missing. <laughs> Gabriela <laughs> knew it. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Teacher, eh, también puedo compartir. You can do it. Go ahead. A wedding? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead. Mm. Eh, es un, es un eh, it's my birthday. Eh, hello, family and friends. 
we are invited to my birthday. My birthday is on Mar March 15th. The theme of the party is a uh, Korean culture. Uh, and you can uh, wear it with uh, K dramas and eat a typical food. The party starts at the 7 p.m. The place of the party will be my home. My home is on the street Sunsal, a number. Uh, the house is seven. Ayutuxtepeque. The itinerary, uh, the first is will be break the cake around the eight o'clock. Uh, also, we will open the gift between nine and nineteen thirty p.m. Uh, we hope you are not missing. I will be there for sure. Korean culture, right? Yes. <laughs> It, yes. We can talk a lot about Korean culture, Andrea. Okay. Thank you, Andrea. I'll be the first one to be there. Okay. Mm. Thank you, Andrea. Let me just let me stop. Don't worry. There, you, there it is. Okay. So let's see another, an expression that we can sentence we can say. Uh, it is, for example, we are inviting you, right? Estamos I invitando. I am here, right? We are inviting. inviting. Yeah. Invite. Inviting you for um, our birthday, right? For my birthday. My birthday. Mm -hmm. And the average, and we, we can say also around eight. Around, around eight. Eight, right? Eight o'clock. Mm. Or okay, eight around. p.m. Or eight p.m. Mm -hmm. Eight p.m. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Okay. To you, Andrea. Okay. Can you choose the next person, please, Andrea? Alison. Alison. Alison, are you there? Yes. Okay. Please share with us your car. Okay. Good. Mm -hmm. Andrea project my invitation. Okay. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, Marita. Andrea, please. Mm. Audit. Thanks, Andrea. How I am? Sorry. Please join us for a uh, Alison birthday on July 30 at 7 p.m. in Luau. We are in the inviting you and one more person to live the great spreading. You can use the poll so you can bring some swing wear. We hope you can come. It's important to confirm attendance. And that's all. Okay, that's all right to be in a swimming party, right? Like a swimming party. But I can yes. swim, Alison. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? I can swim. ¿Qué vamos a hacer, Alison? What can I do? Only the... Only the chiquitos. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Not for me then. Okay, thank you, Alison. Okay. okay, Okay, so there you have. Uh, let's see who is missing. But someone is missing. Yeah. Victor is missing. Cynthia, I don't know if you have it, Cynthia. Yes, yeah, thank you. Okay, perfect. Go ahead. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hi, my friends. I hope you are well. 
the purpose of this email is for invitation for this Saturday at 11 in June. The time at 12 midnight in the restaurant Las Brumas uh -huh. on the street El Volcán. My family and my celebrity, the true anniversary of the company. Uh -huh. We'll see you in the lunch. Goodbye. Thank you. Blake. Okay. Yes. It, it sounds interesting, right? Or it is going to be an email invitation. Okay. Uh, Cynthia, thank you. Let's listen another. Uh, maybe Alejandra is ready. Hello, Alejandra. Is that it? No. Hello. Okay, there you are. Mm -hmm. Perdón. No worries. Go ahead. Bye, bye, bye. Um... Ah, está cargando. Okay, let me know when you are done, please. Okay. Uh... Ah. Okay. Eh, la, la invitación es eh, sobre un aniversario. About an anniversary. Okay, anniversary, sí. The, ha the House of Culture has the, has the honor to invite, 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 invite you, uh -huh. invite invite you. Uh -huh. to Miss eh, Alejandra Portillo uh -huh. as representative of the photography category. Uh -huh. In the, ah, se bloqueó el teléfono, permita. <laughs> In the celebration of the second anniversary. Uh -huh. On Monday in December 2nd. Uh -huh. eh, no sé cómo se dice en 2022, o sea, el año. 2022. 2022. Uh -huh. eh, to our anniversary. Uh -huh. Dinner at the Sheraton Presidente. Uh -huh. Ay, perdón. Uh, Sheraton Presidente at uh, 7 p.m. Uh -huh. o'clock. 7 p.m. Uh, o'clock. En sujet, eh, como vestimenta sugerida. Suggestion, creo que así se dice. Suggestion. Or suggested. Ok. Formal, formal uh, attire. Mm -hmm. Attire. And attire. Mm -hmm. And reservation. Uh, uh, two people. Mm -hmm. I will be a uh, place to mm -hmm. have you present. Okay. I will be happy or glad. También podemos decir. I will be okay. more. I will be. More than happy. More, I will be more than happy to have you in my party, right? Okay, it sounds an elegant party, Alejandra. Okay, I don't know if somebody is missing. If not, I will pass the attendance by way of assistencia and then we finish. Todavía tenemos pendiente la actividad de las penalties, right? I know you want to see, but me just a moment. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know. Okay, so let's go with the attendance and uh, then we finish. We are almost ending this course, right? And then you uh, you will have like one or two weeks to, to, uh, to think, right? If we're going to continue with English corporativo or for relaxing. Okay, so Alejandra is here. Alejandra, present. Okay, thank you. Let's see, Wendy is here. Wendy, yes, there you are. Let's see, um, Alison is here. Alison? Yes, present. Thank you, Alison. Andrea Maria? There you are, thank you, Andrea. Okay, Cynthia is here, Cynthia? Yes, there you are. Then yes, is Dora Guadalupe, Dora, no, Elizabeth Magali, Elizabeth Magali, no, Emma Gloria, 
Emma. Present. Okay, thank you, Emma. Eh, Gabriela Beatriz. Present. Okay, thank you, Gabriela. Jonathan Alexis. Oh, there you are, Jonathan. Jose Luis. Yes, there you are. Karina del Carmen. Karina. Present. There you are. Thank you. Maybe. Yes, there it is. Present. Okay, thank you, Raquel. Raquel Beatriz. Present. Thank you. Dígame. Mi invitación queda pendiente para mañana. Ah, no, ya. Ahorita podemos leerla. Dígame. Let, read it, please. Okay. okay. Uh, big Garage Shay fue invité yo y Saturday John then uh, from uh, 4 p.m. Uh, 4 p.m. Mm -hmm. in the afternoon to our with garage say in which you will be made mm -hmm. offer and discount on glassware and money more to price solo que ahí creo que me faltó agregarle la, la dirección ok el okay. lugar okay. Yo Permítame. Ok, guys. Ok, Raquel. If you can add it y compartir el grupo, uh, I'm going to read it there too. Ok, perfect. Raquel, thank you. Ok, si la podemos agregar solo esta parte para que la podamos eh, leer en el grupo. Ok, eh, solo, solo veo Stephanie Raquel. ¿Está Stephanie Raquel? No. Presente. Ah, oh, no, present. present. Eh, veamos Ruth Verónica. Verónica. No. Ok, and that's it. That's it, guys. Ya, ya tiene, ya tiene asistencia. Gracias. Ok. So, guys, uh, no more questions. See you tomorrow. Tengo 10 minutos por si alguien se quiere quedar. If not, descansemos mucho. And uh, see you tomorrow, guys. Take care. See you. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good, night. Good, night. Good, night. Good night. Good night. Good night, guys. See you. Me. Hola, Cynthia. And yesterday, I called like, the class because I have the training on the company new system. Okay, you have the what? The training. Uh, 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 you have uh, something in the company. Yes. Okay. So next time, maybe what you can do is like uh, you can inform uh, to some of the administratives that are in the WhatsApp group. You can write them so they can be aware because of the minutes that are missing. Remember that at the end, they are the ones that count the minutes you are present in the class. So yes. I suggest you maybe next time, if you can write, you can just mm -hmm. connect. And uh, maybe you 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 don't participate, right? So that can be a possibility, just in case you can. But if not, try to tell them why you or why you cannot be in the class. Okay, Cynthia. Okay. And the other thing, uh, today they call me the you administrator. Mm -hmm. Administrator. Yes. Yeah, I don't know the name, but they tell me about the unit one, the activities. Mm. And in the first weekend, I can start in the class because I see it. Mm. And I, I send the permission for the administrator. Okay, uh, let, let me just check the grades from the first week yeah it looks like you didn't do it but what we can do Cynthia, is that you can do it right in the platform once you okay. do it let me know and i'm gonna check that and i'm gonna write your grade in the system okay i say that you are administrator about this no and... <laughs> 
And save me the... Iba a esperar. But you are going to wait. Ajá. Uh -huh. The way the... You... You... Plat una plataforma. Ok. Ok. Yes. I, I have to write it. But I need you to finish that. Once you do it, let me know and I'm going to add the, the grade. Ah, ok. Ok. Tratemos de terminarlo, please. Y me manda un mensaje de que yeah, you finish. Okay. So I'm going to okay. write the grade. Ok. Cynthia. Ok, thank you. Good night. Problem. Have a good night. See you. Sí. Hello, Verónica.